You shouldn't have come. He took my son. What makes you think I won't do the same? You're better than this. All right, guys. Welcome back. So I was just thinking last night how we're now playing with Atreus. And I hope this has not come into fruition. But in The Last of Us, we played as Ellie. And ultimately, we ended up losing Joel. And the game became about Ellie. It feels weird playing with Atreus. He is incredible. I love playing with him. I actually think it's a phenomenal addition to the series. I'm just saying. Let's not go there, okay? Let's not go there. <laughs> okay. Bad thoughts out the window. Welcome back. We snuck out with uh, with Atreus and Sindri. And uh, we're now back at the house of the dwarves. And Kratos has no idea that we uh, snuck out like a cool little teenage boy. Or at least we don't think he's got an idea. That is not the list that concerns me. Do we trust the path they would put us on? I trust their wisdom. And this is the closest thing to hearing directly from them. You are certain the giants would not counsel war? I said that they were wise. In my experience, that goes with being peaceful. Oh, little brother. Told you we needn't worry. Atreus, where have you been? Peeing? Hope you're all hungry. I can oh eat. My God. <laughs> oh, oh. oh my God. Is everyone as well rested as I am? <laughs> Be right down. Oh, I love it. The humor, man. This is great. This is freaking great. Is this sausage? Uh, sure. Why not? I remember food tasting better. I suppose you'd like to try cooking for this one. I accept. What? I'm sure that's where I'm planning our next move. Oh, so where are we going? Alfheim, home of the elves. Alfheim? You hate Alfheim. Why would we move there? I do too. Move there? Oh, we are. Seeking information. The shrine of Groa, young one. Your father tells me you found it there. Groa? The knowledge keeper? Oh, maybe there's a secret there I can unlock. Aye. Who better than the seer who saw everything? Hmm. I wasn't sure you, um. <clears throat> Never mind. That's great. How fun. Hey, don't go forgetting this, what'll get you there. You know what? I'm gonna build a bigger table. <laughs> like a little family, man. This is so cool. More for me. Tear, you're really up for coming with us? I am. Whenever you're ready. Well. Whenever your father's ready, I should say. If my counsel might help you towards the answers you seek, it's the least I can do to repay you. Plus, I think it will do me well to see the light of Elfheim again. Hmm. That elf light is some good shit. Ah, nice. So maybe now with him we can... We can interact with those little blowholes or whatever. So... Where did this plan come from? Oh, from Mimir, of course. I was merely asking how you found me, and he explained the secret prophecies inside the Yodnar shrines. Fascinating. From there, we sent you taking stock of which shrines we'd seen, at which point your father recalled finding growers outside the Temple of Light. And now that we can actually go to Alfheim, the prudent course of action became self-evident. Nary a last step for the world's smartest man. Even without feet, if you'll forgive the levity. I was always fond of our talks, you yeah. know? Aye. And it's good to see you a free man again, old friend. Hmm. 
Alrighty. The companion accessory slot is empty. Select your companion in the armor. Oh. Wait, what? A sonic aftershock. Accessories are equipped here. Accessories can be found in the world. Melee attacks against an enemy afflict. Afflicted with Sonic do bonus stun. Inc upgrades decrease the stun dealt. Or increase. I'm sorry. Increase. Alright, let's do this. Right behind you. I'll meet you at the gateway presently, friends. Got, got the most important thing, Kratos. The smartest man in the world. Excuse me, sir. Mind if I take a little peek at you? I promise I'll be brief. Huh? Oh, that's that squirrel. My goodness, what a strapping physique. Capable of an astounding variety of acts of violence, I imagine. What is happening? <laughs> this must be the squirrel that tends the world tree. That delectable aroma. Could it be? Pardon the intrusion. Ah, yes. Amber resin. Delightfully nutty with a hint of squidding. No. Not one for gastronomic expiration, I see. Wait, if you're Radit Hosker, why are you so different when we summon you for help? It's a long story. <laughs> but you are correct. I am indeed Radit Hosker. The one you know as Radit Hosker is merely one of my spectral aspects. And a particularly nasty one at that. I consider him so far removed from myself that he's practically a different person. Speaking of... Bitter, would you like to come out and see your friends? Back off! I'm busy! I suppose that was to be expected. Anyway... Ooh. Now that I've polished off all this resin for you, would you like the seed back? It is the seed. Indeed. A seed of Yggdrasil, to be precise. Since my dwarven tenants <laughs> performed their little reconfiguration, you'll need seeds like these to open up new destinations on my tree. <laughs> Your tree, huh? Yes, my tree. <laughs> Here, let me show you. So that's why good Master Brock needed an Alpine seed. Clearly, you have important matters afoot. I feel, it still feels like this game is only beginning, which is crazy. So the paths are split like branches of the Yggdrasil. Alfheim awaits with a long and difficult journey. The training grounds of Niflheim hold secret rewards. Uh, Svartalfheim, Jesus Christ, may hold unfinished businesses. Choose carefully. Um, that okay. seed you found unlocks Niflheim of all places, a realm as ancient as it is vaguely sticky. Screw it. If we're not going to Alfheim yet, it's probably best for Tyr to wait for us here. Exactly. The soldiers we fought in Svartalfheim, those were Enriar? I thought Enriar were just spirits in Valhalla until Ragnarok comes. They were no spirits. Indeed, brother. Odin appears to have found a loophole. Activated his forces early as a standing army. Perhaps something he could only do without any honest Valkyries around to stand in his way. Yeah, I'm not I'm not trying to rush the game, to be honest. Not right now. I'm good. Look at this. Look at this. Oh my goodness. The Raven Tree. Whoa. Do we have to be here? 
creeping me out all these <laughs> bastards with their souls cut up uh yeah this is this is insanely cool wow there's something over here ah a memory of war. you could use this as a training arena <clears throat> if you like you'll just be fighting the recollections of enemies they won't be able to harm you no because there's no there's no rewards for this so i'm good i just read there's no there's literally no xp rewards or anything so wait are those odin's ravens the ones we've been destroying all this time so it would seem wait where are they oh shoot Man, that tree looks incredible. Free are we. Free of the Father. Our half-wise now belong to no other. What do you think that means? I don't know. But there's definitely something more going on here. Ravens required. Ah, I see. Seven of forty-eight. Interesting. So the more ravens we collect, they start becoming unlocked. Brock, what do you think about fate? I don't. Either your life's all written down somewhere, or it ain't. Still feels like you're making choices either way. The shit smells the same regardless of how it got shat. Remind me to write that down. All right, so what we're going to do, we're going to head back. And uh, I guess right now, there's nothing to, to do here until we collect more ravens, which is totally fine. The crucible. We still cannot go to the crucible. I'm going to have to go back to Sindri's house. And then after that... Mimir, I know this sounds weird, but... We'll go. Can you tell me again what happens when someone dies? Every living thing has a soul, and every soul has four parts. Form, mind, direction, and luck. Direction steers the souls of giants, dwarves, elves, and animals toward the Lake of Souls in Alfheim, where all the parts may be absorbed back into Alfheim's great light. So that's where Fenrir is? The Lake of Souls? So long as his soul still has its direction, aye, it's well on its way. Wow. Wow. He was also probably asking because remember, Sindri spoke to him about Brock. Ah, there you are. I knew you hadn't forgotten me. <laughs> Master Kratos, I would speak with you. Sure. Speak. If you are ever in need of my services and I am not present, I have installed these handy chimes for you to notify me. Simply throw your axe and strike the chimes, and I will attend to your needs. Would you care to take a practice throw? A magnificent throw, Master Kratos. Truly a seasoned pro. Very well. You know how to reach me now. Well then, what else, friends? I have a question. Splendid! I delight in offering my tutelage to the Inquisitive. Over the ledge, by the gateway over there. I noticed these dragons. Dragons? Oh no, young Master Atreus. Those are leaned worms, the brood of Neithog. Neithog? That's the mother? Correct. She's also a vital piece of the Yggdrasilian circle of life, as it were. I tend the branches up here, while Neithog chews the roots from below to prevent overgrowth. A delicate balance. So they're friendly? Well, they're not nearly so affable as myself, but there's no reason to expect hostility so long as they're left in peace. Neithog is a stern matriarch, as protective of her offspring as she is determined to teach them proper discipline. That sounds... Familiar. <laughs> Carry on, my friend. Very oh, so cool. That's it. Yeah, that's... <laughs> Go away now. Do we ever get to see the bitter squirrel or what? We still can't go back here, it seems. I don't think we'll ever be able to, anyways. Let me see if Tyr has anything to say. He does not. He's a quiet one. Alright. 
again this is where we go for the eyes of odin and this we cannot go here yet so for whatever reason it says available but we cannot go there perhaps as we travel you can tell me the tale of your prior visit to the land of the elves sure i can oh boy Alfheim was the first time we ever realm traveled using your temple. Freya tried coming with us, but Odin cast a spell on her. She can't leave Midgard. That's terrible. So then we fought our way through an army of dark elves to get to the light. You interfered in the elf war. Not by choice. Hmm. We sought to fill our Bifrost, and they attacked us. And the dark elves were covering it with their sticky hive stuff. When we freed it, light elves came back. We seemed better in Alfheim. <laughs> Did they now? Man, I hated fighting those damn elves. Hopefully we don't have to do that again. <laughs> they were they were pretty Alfheim. It's been so long. Not sure where the temple is from here, but that's where we'll find Grow a Shrine. Grow a secret. Reach Grow a Shrine atop the temple. Now it's three of us, Open four of us. <laughs> Aye, not exactly an easy fix for that. Four characters. Their war. Yeah, so much for things being better in Alpha. Oh boy. Oh boy. Ooh. There's a chest yeah, down I below. Thimble Winter hit Alpha hard. No. Storms have plagued Alfheim's deserts long before Fimble Winter. Hold on a second here. Living desert. Huh. Don't mind if I do. Slag deposits. That's exactly what I was looking for. Can I go down there? Hold on. I'll meet you on the other side. I can't. Hold on. I hear something out there. Something big. <laughs> in pain Ooh, a chest and another chest all right so we've got to go down over there west i'm gonna drop down here What's see if we can here? feels like some kind of animal how could anything live in a storm like that plenty of caves under the desert not exactly a paragon of comfort but the Dark Elves get on best they can. That's two. We're missing one more. There, the Temple of Light. Grow a shrine is at the top. Ah. Good eye. Five frost eyes. <laughs> Damn it, Mimir. Is everything okay? Hi, old friend. Just looting you on your chest. We'll be right along. <laughs> My dad likes loot. <laughs> My dad likes loot. All right, so we need two Fair more. Enough. Two more apples to increase our health again, which again, uh, very much needed to the dangers that we're headed to. never bothered returning to Alfheim, did he, Mimir? I no. I assumed the fate of his own realm took precedence. Wait, Freya's brother? Yes. Cut from a different cloth, that one. Everything seems too quiet right now. I don't trust it. There's a barricade up ahead. What are those shiny rocks? Twilight Stone. A rare material that can take millennia to form. Majestic, isn't it? 
Occasionally, the light of Alfheim will bind to a rock and crystallize, growing like moss on a fallen tree. Oh, I didn't know it could do that. Reflect indicator changes color when lined up to a target. There's a gap in the fence over there. Is there now? Oh, right here. Oh, I see. Damn. Oh. Okay. Very <laughs> clever. Is there anything here? Maybe this is just to trick us out. That's probably what it is. Make us think we're supposed to hit that one when we're not. Oh God. Oh yes. I feel so strong. We good? Oh my. Oh, whoa, whoa. You guys are guarding this treasure chest like your life depends on it. Mumia, do you understand these poems? Oh, there's always meaning if you look hard enough, brother. It's all in what you bring to it. A tracking axe throw that ricochets between targets. Marking, uh, marked by pressing R2. Hmm. So if I go to weapons, Leviathan X. Okay. What? That's pretty cool. I'll keep mine for now. I feel like it's going to get me out of trouble. I need to. Freya's brother. How was he involved? Long ago, Freya of the Vanir traveled to Alfheim, where he discovered a once beautiful land devastated by war. Using his divine powers, he set about cultivating a tenuous peace among the elves. Did what you the mention heck? how that peace fell apart as soon as he left? I was getting to it. <laughs> you hear that? Oh no. Uh -oh. That's enough, please. We don't need to do this. We don't want to hurt you. We do not have a choice. Come on, guys. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> Why are you fighting us? We helped you last time. Atreus, focus. I need help. The most unfortunate. They attacked us. More will follow once we're inside. Is there mm. truly no other way? Not like they're giving us much of a choice. So your father said. I'm just naive, I suppose. No. Just an optimist, old friend. Alright. Those are the dark elves, right? Yeah. Alright, we have here another chest. It's a prayer made by the elves. He must have left it here when he raced back to Vanaheim. What is this? A charm to ward off nightmares. In this case, flares. Well, knowing the elves, there are probably more tributes to find. <laughs> Best to move on for now, brother. Don't think we have the right tools for this one. Oh, come on, man. You're going to give me a chest and make me ignore it. Are you insane? It's so tall. We came in from the top last time. I didn't realize all this was even down here. It's an older gate, built to promote cooperation between the elves. But it looks like it's been sealed for some time. 
How do we enter? I'll go first. Atreus, let me know when I've reached halfway. Mm, so, okay. uh, what's happening right now? This seal is meant to represent the balance of the realm when Freyr was here. Light and dark, working together in harmony. How's that look, Atreus? Good, I think. Father, huh? now you go. Unfortunately for Alfheim, Freyr couldn't accept his sister's decision to marry Odin. He returned to Vanaheim and left this realm to its fate. To be fair, the Aesir did set him on fire that one time. Hmm. Hmm. The door should have opened. Are you sure it's balanced? Yeah, but the realm isn't. Not anymore. Father, try pulling it the other way. Yeah, yeah! And here, you keep pushing forward. figure that out but <laughs> shall we yes we shall oh what's a dark elf statue doing in the light temple that's just how they looked before the division the division yes <laughs> the elves weren't always split between light and dark you know this statue depicts the elves before the war, before they discovered the power of the light. Hmm. Yes. Wow, that's so the cool. Stone briefly imparts a bit of light to your axe. That's useful. That's very useful. Oh. What's that sound? I don't like it. No sense in spoiling the surprise. <laughs> Man, these things are creepy, dude. Oh, it's the light. Oh. Whoa. I've never seen the Lake of Souls so volatile. Aye. Fimple winter, you reckon? Of course making the light unstable. So the base of this light well, that's the Lake of Souls. Yes. After the creation of the Nine Realms, fallen souls began to gather down in those waters. When the elves discovered its potential, they built this temple to harness that energy. A smashing success, to say the least. Many of them became addicted to their newfound power, and thus, the light elves were born. Hmm. Okay. <laughs> Thanks for the history lesson, boys. Much appreciated. All right, so we've got this here. Before I shine the light, let me just make sure nothing here. Uh, okay. So this is interesting. Um Ah, look at this. Depending on how far you are from it too, huh? Okay. Well done. Though I imagine our light elf friends will be less than pleased. Just so beautiful. Speaking and here they are. Elves, that? Let me try talking to them again. They Best may... just to let these two do their thing, brother. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, you guys asked for it. 
You asked for the Blades of Chaos. You've never seen the Blades of Chaos, have you? Oh. Any little shitty flying tactics gonna help you now? Oh wow, he blocked that. Quickly double tap on one to interrupt the blue attack. Oh wow. Jesus! My goodness. Now the elves have always been one of those enemies that are just uh poor souls. They're they're strong, man. Here. They came across on light bridges. But now the bridges are gone. I have an idea to get us across. Huh. Lucky for us, swearing off violence doesn't mean he can't disfigure some mm -hmm. architecture. <laughs> this way. Shrine mm -hmm. awaits. That's true. Wow. This guy is an incredible addition to the squad. I love it. Kratos, where are you going? He's looking around. He ah, <laughs> oh, curious mind. Carry on. I'm a man of shortcuts, Mr. Tear. The temple looks so different than I remember. It was all broken and covered in hive stuff last time we were here. Mm -hmm. These elves use Alfheim's light to enhance the temple and themselves by the look of it. They definitely look more dangerous than last time. Oh, those were just the foot soldiers. They'll get more dangerous the further up we go. Oh, yeah? Thanks for letting me know, uh, Mimir. Can we just go back home now? I would appreciate it. Is this way, Kratos. Yeah, you know, just like to be the right. Find you. Oh, how do I get that? I'll be right back for you, Odin. I'll be right back for you. Yeah. I had to explore. Hades distribution is that for the blades of chaos? Oh, hell yeah. Absolutely. Yeah, I need to get that shit. Oh, sneaky. <laughs> sneaky, sneaky. Very sneaky. Shall we continue? Wow, so that was really sneaky. The light to build doors and make himself stronger. What do the Dark Elves want with it? To return it back to its source. To them, the natural resources of Alfheim are safe, none more so than the light itself. Aye, the light elf's success came at a terrible price. Alfheim's once lively desert withered into a storm-ridden wasteland soon after the creation of this temple. I right, saw. So. There's more Twilight Stone up there. Yep. Oh, I can. Oh, I can walk through here. I didn't even realize that. You're building quite the collection of poetry, brother. Why so surprised? My people are known for their culture. Not surprised. <laughs> Esteem. Not if you've 
better angle on that fire. More light elves ahead. I'll handle this. Uh, maybe that's not a great idea. Oh, there, friends. Salutations. We mean you no harm. Here. Get back. Wow, I didn't have the axe on me. Oh shit, my bad. Oh, that was whack. Bastard. Ooh. These are the mystic elves. Mystic my ass. Done. Find you, watch out. Okay, hold on. There you go. Wait, <laughs> what? It is stick to him. Oh, BS. Left side, keep coming. <laughs> Ooh. That's it. You guys fucked up. <laughs> oh my goodness. At least I tried. <laughs> when in doubt. Why they keep fighting? The dark elves want the souls and the light left alone. But the light elves want to keep using them. That's the long and short of it. Aye. So then, which side is right? I'm not our place to say. This is an elven conflict. I said as much the last time we were in Alfheim. Right. When in doubt, just use the rage, bro. Use the rage. And you'll be just fine. Shit always comes in clutch. Now, there is a chest over there, which I'm assuming once we go through these double doors here, we'll be able to access it. What is this? Made a lot of these light doors. Mm. Fortifications. Aye. None too eager to let the dark elves run the roost again. Uh-huh. Chest is right. Yeah. I don't think that's the way up to the shrine. We know there's a chest over here. Oh, I see it now. Forgive nah. my patience. Oh, tricky. Tricky, tricky. Nothing is too tricky for Kratos. Or right, hold on, I'll take that back. Oh, I still had the axe over there. <laughs> I had no idea. Once referred to as the dragon's bane. Oh no. Oh, these little things are so annoying. Incoming! Right side! Oh! So we'll go back up here and I'll use our Leviathan axe. Excellent. Let's continue our set, yes? Those things are annoying, dude. Jesus. So, which is your favorite of Gavassia's poems, brother? Why would I choose a favorite? <laughs> this man. <laughs> the way he talks is just so cool. Oh 
boy. I suppose I'll leave you to it. Should have not done that. Man, that guy was fucking gnarly. Sheesh. Oh, there's more. <laughs> oh my god. So they came from over here. I'll meet you on the other side. So I'm gonna go ahead and check out. What is this? A shortcut? Oh, well, this is a freaking. Oh, this is that one chest. Oh my goodness! <laughs> I completely forgot about this. Jump. All right, Tear. Do your thing, bro. Oh, actually, never mind. I don't need you anymore. Hmm. Hold on. What's this guy doing? Oh, damn. He got smoked. He had no idea what was coming. <laughs> All right, this is the Love way we got to go. Okay. okay, good. Now that we know that. Hold on. You know me, man. I'm an explorer. I'm an explorer, son. That's the wrong. Oh. Go ahead and grab this other chest here. Before moving forward. Simple trinket signifying rebirth. Uh, is that for like a, is that like a resurrection sort of thing? Like if I die, come back to life. Just so cool. All right, let's get it. What does Tear do? He just jumps up or? Almost there, by the way. Ooh. Do what you must. Oh my Take god. Fuck, oh, man, that shit is annoying. <laughs> Sorry, pals. Figure out how they're making light bridges. Look at this statue. These crystals. I've noticed them on the elves as well. What do we do here? I wonder. This statue were to fall over the castle. All right, hold on. I'm just gonna push this. Oh, nice. Oh, crystals still make light bridges. Now the light elves wear them. Smart. Almost there. Allow me. Oh, wait, what? And this dude is deceiving. Like, he doesn't look how easy. You enjoy the vandalism. <laughs> Pretty soon he'll be laying waste to pottery. Shall we wow. So what is this for here? Like. I'm wondering if this could be used for something like I'm missing something. Hmm, hopefully not. Hmm. 
we've got an R here. Hold on. An N. Sweet deal. Let's get it. So what I'm gonna do is, uh, we've got that one there. Look over there. Got to be another one close by. Hold on. Where's the third one? Ah. All right, perfect. Why must they insist on trial? You would know better than us, brother. I can't remember the last time I visited the Nords, nor do I wish to try. Need two more for the rage. All right, perfect. I see them. Smokes. Is that it? Little punks. That's all you got? Uh, there's some different bridges here I've seen. Um. Brighter than I remember. I guess we could have just used that to fight the elves. Making sure we're not leaving anything behind. That's all. some fighting each other had prayer not abandoned the realm a lasting peace may have formed but now hmm. can we really place all the blame on prayer this war started long before his arrival but he had the power to heal this land and end the war did he not he made his choice the wrong one for alfheim perhaps but not necessarily for him wow. hmm. those were all entitled to walk their own path they right, so we gotta move the other statue I'm thinking mm. yeah 
Should be it. Find out. Ah. That looks right. Jesus Christ. <laughs> well, now we just gotta angle it properly on this side. Come back up here. There it goes. Did it break? No? Fine job, brother. This way. Excellent. We're finally outside, which is where we've been wanting to go all the way to the top, the top of this light temple. Let's take a look at the goals here. Much has changed since the last time we we're here. Nalfheim must travel through the temple of light to reach Gro's shrine. All right, guys. So we're going to end it here. I believe on the next episode, we will reach the top of this temple. And uh, that's where our adventure continues. I'm trying to make these episodes a little bit shorter just because it's easier for me to upload them in 4K. They get um they get processed a lot quicker versus when I do like 2-hour episodes. That can easily take like 10 plus hours. So uh be patient with me. Keep supporting the videos if you enjoy them. The more support the more videos, obviously. But uh this is great so far. Thank you guys. Catch you on the next one.